Uh, so I have this problem on the board. We have a double square root on the left side, square root and the square root of 21x plus 30 equals the square root of 2x plus 5. And what I'm going to do first is I'm going to square both sides. And we'll have 21x plus 30 equals 2x plus 5. And then we'll just square it again on both sides. Okay. So then we'll have 21x plus 30 equals 4x squared plus 20x plus 25. Okay. And then for the next step, what we want to do is we want to get everything on one side. So we could hopefully get this. Well, not hopefully it's going to work. We're going to get this into a, um, quadratic so we'll have 4x squared um, minus x minus 5 yeah that's right okay and now we just need to factor that let's try it like this so we'll say 4x So we'll look at it like that, 4x times x is 4x squared, and then we'll do um, 5 here, or 1 here. Um, does that look good? Yep, that looks good. So we have this factorization, so that gives us uh, two answers for x. So we have x equals 5 fourths, and x equals negative 1. As our two roots, then we can check each of these going back to the original problems. We want to make sure we don't get an extraneous root. Uh, first, let's plug in. Let's look at the negative one first and plug it in. So if we get, let's see, the square root of the square root of 21 times negative 1 plus 30. That's going to be, uh, this whole thing is going to be 9. Square root of 9 three and the square root of the square of the square root of the square root of nine is the square root of three. And then on the other side, the square root of two times negative one plus five, that's also going to be the square root. So that solution's good. And then we want to check five fourths. So let's see, twenty-one times five fourths. This looks a little harder. Or messier. Um, yeah, what's that going to be? We're going to have, let's change color. So we're going to have 105 over 4. And then 30 is actually, we can write that as 120 over 4. Okay. Let's see, if we combine those, we're going to have. 225 over 4, which is going to be the square root of 15 halves. And I think we'll just leave it as 15 halves because we can't simplify it anymore. Then let's look at the other side of the equation. The square root of 2 times 5 fourths plus 5. And that's going to be, let's see. That's going to be the same thing as 5 halves plus halves equals 15 halves. So that's a good solution as well. Whoa, sorry about that. Okay, so we have our two solutions. Let's just check our answer here. Minus 1, 5 fourths. That's correct. So in this quiz, the double square root challenge, all the problems are just the same form. So it's just kind of for practice to do these repeatedly. Um, there's not really any twist to them. They're just kind of the, really the same problem with just different results. And I got the idea for this one. There was a video from the math sorcerer. This was a good video. And if you want to check out that video, you can scroll into the description and view that. And I got a recap of the process that we just did here. So hopefully that was useful, and we'll stop it there.